You can't steer an airliner with the rudder when you're taxiing slow. It literally does nothing. Rudders only work when air flows over them. No airflow, no force. Below about 10 knots, there's not enough wind for the rudder to have any meaningful effect. It's just a big fin sitting there doing nothing. So how do pilots turn the plane on the ground? They use a nose wheel tiller, a little wheel near the side window. That directly steers the nose gear left or right. No airflow required. You can pivot a 250-ton jet without moving your feet. Once the plane speeds up on the runway, the rudder becomes effective again, around 40 to 60 knots. That's when it starts adding your control. But during taxi? All turns come from the tiller. Rudder's just along for the ride. Big jets need tight turns in tight places. Gates, taxiways, ramps. Some tillers give over 70 degrees of nose wheel deflection. Pedals can't do that. They're limited to small angles in case of rudder failure. So if you see sharp steering on the ground, that's hand-driven. So no, the rudder isn't your steering wheel below 10 knots. It's dead weight until airflow kicks in. You want to turn a jet on the ground? You use your hand, not your feet. It's why every airliner comes with two pilots and one tiny wheel that turns the beast.